do something, son. Yes, I promise to sit. I promise to sit. Over. I promise to sit. Over. Please, over. You, August, take off it. You, move the lap lift. Move! Sit and you sit. Sit! Go, 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 If you move, I shoot you. You are dead. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Shoot. Don't shoot me. Telling us government to pay. I told him to resign from this <laughs> year. I told him. Ah, what he do? I love his government and the bank salary. He got me now. I don't die. Hey, he got me now. Oh, oh, eh? You should not think of his uh, how to bury him. Mm. Eh? You come to the office oh. tomorrow with his relatives. Let's sign some documents oh. and process the welfare package. Mm. They will pay. What are you saying? Why are you lying? Why are you lying? Why are you going to pay him? Eh? They didn't pay you when he was alive. Why do you go make people tell so much lies to us poor people? Why? Why can't you just tell us it? How are you going to pay my school fees? Go on, God. My school fees. <laughs> How am I going to finish school? Oh God! I don't have anyone else in this wide world. God, that's you. That's you. as if old age is a sin, treating us with levity. Hey, young lady, 
Are you not the one he's talking to? Or don't you think some of us here are old enough to be your grandfather? Oga pensioner, what do you want me to do? No accreditation paper, no pay voucher, and the worst of it all, no money. Ha! Ah. So why did you people ask us to come and stay here? No big government say make me not tender now. Now them still say I should sit here and wait. My house rent, my children's school fees. Even my wife said there's no ten for my girl remaining in the house to feed the family. How am I going to feed these children? Eh? How am I going to feed these children? I have bought credit. Until they said I have refused to say to us anymore. She's even now in my house waiting to collect her money. I've been postponing, postponing. I don't even know what to tell her anymore. Young lady, tell me the truth. You mean to say there is no money, true, true? No money. I will advise you people to save your energy and go home. Go, go to which home? I borrowed the money to transport myself here. And there is no cobble with me right now. Mm. Huh? serve this country judiciously with all our strength. But the new generations came looting money and allowing us to die in hunger. All I know is that a people without a past shall never have a future. I for that. I go 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 Work. Yes, I want to work. For oh, this place? Yes. This one, your hand will begin to shake like this already. <laughs> I beg, come go out. Not come die for person neck for your beg. My son. Uh, my son, I will not put you into trouble. I need to raise some money. Please, I will work. Baba, please go home. Not come die for here. Not put person for trouble. I will not. Come and see what I Please, I want yeah. to work. Please. I beg, work, work, work for me. Baba, go home. Leave this place oh, now. Baba, I so. Why are you being so rude to an old man like this? Eh? I'm gonna be so. See, the man say one carry sand. This old man won't carry sand. The work too strong for them. Carry sand, okay. sir. I need the job to raise my transport fare back home. I'm a pensioner. I came to collect my salary, but they refuse to pay us, and I don't even have money to transport myself back home. Now I'm making one contact for personal. Ah, uh, Oga, 
Where do you come from, please? Ibadan, sir. Oh, Ibadan. Yes, sir. And how much do you think can be enough for you to go back? Uh, 200 naira, sir. 200 naira. Are yes, you sir. sure? Yes, I'm okay. sure, sir. Button your, your shirt, please. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, you can manage with this 500 naira. Oh, thank you very much. My God will bless you. Amen. You are a very kind man. Okay. May you never laugh. Amen, sir. Thank you. Amen. Thank you, huh? Yeah. Supervisor. I think next time you should find nice people so that you will live long. Uh, yes, huh? sir. But, but no issues, sir. This is Lagos. Come and feed the boo If he be say just one kuja house, <laughs> then make me just to protect your interests, okay? Make the man not come put you for trouble. Come and love you to eat it here, What does that supposed to mean? No, now I just say make you not take you come spoil our own. Is your mother here? Uh, yes, okay. inside. Thank you. Welcome, sir. welcome, sir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you crazy? Come on, give my money. What is the problem? He's not what is he? He's collected my money. Pay for me. Take it out. Give him back his money. Why are you doing this? Papa is back. I'm home. Ah, Papa Suzanne. He could say you don't come home. Not be small Bahana. We and landlord do. Um, um, this some money make I go buy food for the children to eat first. Take this three hundred and fifty naira. I had to walk a long distance to save that amount from the five hundred naira a kind man gave me. The government has disappointed us. As usual. Hi. I am frustrated. I don't know what to do again. Papa Susan, you mean say they don't pay you any money? They don't pay any money? Government not pay. Hey, Chineke. I can't see them. How we go handle them now? The food woman says. Go call police if you know Pierre. They don't send Junior from school because of school fees. Hey! Oh! The worst of all, they say, landlord don't send us quick notice. And they say if we no pack out before next tomorrow, he go remove the sink and be the roof of this house. His house rent don't reach one year.
some wine, no. okay? You. Hmm, Stella, <laughs> you're looking younger and younger every day. Really? Every passing day. Really? Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> and uh, unfortunately, I cannot say the same of you. It's <laughs> <laughs> true. Look, Jenny. Each time I visit you, I feel so sad when I leave. You feel so sad? Yes. Yeah. Jenny, you used to be the toast among all girls until you now rushed into this stupid marriage of Fethin. <laughs> Stella, I thought marriage is what every woman wants to do. Heavens forbid. If this is what marriage is all about, I will better remain a spinster. Uh -huh. Okay, let me ask you. Jenny, how much do you have in your account to show for it? My account, yes. I don't even have an account in the first place. I don't have any. You <laughs> see? Mm -hmm. That is why Chiyer, all be and grace dumped you. It's just that I like you. That's why I visit you. Okay. Jenny, look at me very well. As I'm sitting right here before you now, I have four. Four good al -Hajis and two Tokumbo boyfriends that service my account regularly. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. In short, I have more than two million naira deposited in my account and some other rounds, baby. Two million I'm naira. I'm telling you. Still like your kid. <laughs> I know you won't believe me. <laughs> but it's a fact. Are you saying the truth? I'm telling you the fact. I'm serious. <laughs> two million naira. naira. Yes. And that is how it should be. Hmm. Two million. Hmm. Stella, Frank has been really nice to me. I can't, no. <laughs> see, he has treated me so well. Jenny, see you talking like a baby. Hmm? What's your husband? No. Okay. To go to market or visit your relations. I do, but I always go with my driver. Here you are, baby. Then you now plan with the driver. Driver self need money. Okay, number two. Always make sure that you are harsh to him. I mean, Jenny, look for every opportunity to have a quarrel with him. That he becomes a nervous wreck. You cannot control him. But if that doesn't work out, still no problems. I will still take you to my white garment prophet. I can't, no. <laughs> See, he has treated me so well. He bought me a car. All I did was just ask, and he bought it. In fact, anytime I ask him to give me money, he never hesitates. Because you ask for peanuts. Look, Jenny. You take my advice or remain a baby factory. When he sucks you dry, he dumps you in the boy's quarter and marry a new wife. Oh, no, not Frank. <laughs> no. Okay. Frank can do that. Um, it's like, let's go out. 
so that I will go and shine your eyes. And you'll see the things you'll be missing. <laughs> Stella. All right, let me just change it to something else. Okay? All right. I'll join you in a minute. Okay. Um, not all this your better and then. Oh, please. <laughs> Put better or all those skin and You know now, the things you will use and get them. <laughs> Yes, madam. She got sir. Ah. Why didn't she let the driver take her? She don't agree, sir. Where's my wife? She went out. And she left us all alone? She said she was going out with her friend. Um, as no so eating. Yes, uncle. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, you take that one upstairs. Okay. Oh, Frank, you're back. Where have you been? I went out. And you didn't let her uh, open drive you? I felt like trying. Are you waiting dressed like this? Like an irresponsible mother? Frank, I don't see anything wrong with what I'm wearing. Please, don't start. Please. To make things worse, you haven't left Lonzo all alone. I think it's about time you start getting used to it. Besides, I don't see anything wrong with you babysitting for a little while. It's not been long since I left the house. That is not what Clara said. Oh, really? So... Clara is now your ward dog in this house, eh? I am going to send that girl out of this house myself if she does not start minding her own business. <laughs> you dare not. Baby, you over bad, eh? Not just trying. So how far now? Baby, no far. It's very close. Tell me, tell me. I say very, very near. For your domots. Are you serious? <laughs> Don't be smart, you know. Anyway, bring her down reach here. No. Jenny, you and I, your boy, sir. Eh? Like I say, you don't they die for the boy, oh. My sister. Not blame you. The boy hold enough energy. Hey, hey enough energy, I tell you. Let hey. me smart. Hey. <laughs> Jenny. If you see the color of see how okay, why Angela I buy it? <laughs> Baby, your mind go blow. Huh? You know, say Angela, not they just send anybody. Mm. She get Mr. I won't buy cow, but my husband no just agree. A good price won't convert. Now I tell the man, the man begin vogue. Now I vogue follow and come up for house. Which can't thing? Then bone the marriage now. Which can't suffer be that one? My sister, I know easy to bone. The man they drop rush now. What they flow? I know if you bone and just like that. No, no complaint now. After you, man, you get small, small things where you they spend for. <laughs> <laughs> I say the boy over there. I say hey, baby. I say the boy enough energy. Look, you know, go try there. My I don't know if he tried that boy. <laughs> <laughs> I just come with a small rouge. Hey. Two thousand dollars. Now I go clean her up. You know, yeah. take her enter shop. Ah, bros. Which one you the delay moves now? Eh? Your your mumsy. Which mumsy? <laughs> Which mumsy? Eh, Which mumsy? Give me one can work, sure. Make you not be saying all those small small girls now you they follow. Ah, no, if no, I no. catch you, I will not deny you. I will not deny you. This is not two thousand. Hey, 
Baby. I trust you. To so make you go, go down. <laughs> I will carry you go boutique. I don't need this level. This can canvas t shirt level. I will carry you enter boutique. I will go clean you, bath you. That's why they talk of you now. <laughs> anyway, no, no, why now you dead like here? Hey, hey, all these boys. See, I don't see money now. I don't need no, shoes. Not <laughs> don't worry. Now me will drive you. And for your information, I can buy a car for myself. Jennifer, my $2,000 got missing in my room today. And it caused an embarrassment for me at work. $2,000. So what are you asking me? Should I ask your driver, the cleaners, the steward, even the cook to ask for Why Jennifer? So who did? I think I took your money. But wait, $2,000. How come? Yes, $2,000. That's serious. Oh, yes. Are you serious? Oh, I'm very, very serious. Are you serious? Frank, you know. You know that no matter how bad things has gone between us, I can't stoop so low as to steal from you. I mean, if I need money, I'll tell you. But $2,000 missing in this house is not a thing one should take lightly. Well, there is something I've been meaning to tell you. What is it? I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to be very sure of what I am saying. But now that it has gotten this far, I think I better just talk about it. What is it? Frank. Your niece, Clara. I have seen that girl pinch things, so to speak, from my room and even your room about twice. I did not want to talk about it until I was very sure, but this issue of $2,000 missing, I don't put it past her. I believe she's the one that has taken the money. My niece? Yes. All right. And you're very sure about this? Okay. Uh, Clara! Just take it easy. Just Clara! Come here. Yes, uncle. Clara. Listen to me and listen to me carefully. I am going to ask you this only once. And you had better tell me the truth. Now, did you steal any money from my room? Money? No, sir. I didn't. Did you steal any $2,000 from my room? No, sir. I didn't, sir. Obviously, she's lying. Look at her. You're lying. You don't want to own up, right? I'm just telling you. Shut up! Why are you denying? Eh? Or oh, because I have not reported you all this while. She's the one that has the money. She will never own up. So there's no need asking her if she's the one. Because she is the one, but she will never own up. Oh. I see. Okay. I see. Okay. okay. If that's what you want, go and pack your things and leave my house. Uncle, please. Uncle, please don't drive me out. I don't have anywhere to go. This is my first time. You're the only uncle I have. Uncle, I don't have anywhere to go. Please, Uncle, please. <laughs> Auntie, please, Auntie, please, I just want to be here. has been mingling with all the houseboys, stewards, and drivers in this estate. Yes, and I am very, very sure they are the ones she's giving all the money she's taking from this house. Now, you listen. I am going upstairs. By the time I come down into this living room and meet you here, you see the other side of Auntie, please. Blimey. You know you can see my husband's name. I don't think I can see it. Auntie, please, Auntie, please, don't call me. Oh, I said to God, I need to any money, Uncle. Please, 
好困了，哎，坐坐。站住。Now, what am I going to do? See, 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 see the landlord. What do I go to? Eh? It's no money, nothing. Okay, don't worry, Mama. Don't worry. Let me, let me go and speak with him. Mm, let me talk to him. You want to go and see? Oh, yeah, let me talk. To him. Oh, God, please let him, let him listen to you, please. Hi. Good afternoon, sir. Susan, I gave your parents eight months. Eight months, very months for you. Haven't I tried? Eh? Look, I am beginning to run out of patience. So, boy, it is either your mother pays up at the end of this month, or well, I will come and remove the roof of this house. Please, sir. Please have mercy on us, sir. My mommy just started the petty business. I've been trying to gather the the money we, we, we get from the business. By the time it's enough, we'll, we'll, bring, we'll bring the money, sir. Petty business, kid. She petty business, no fair fish on oil, eh? Petty business. But look, Susan, you are no longer a small girl. You cannot live on petty business. Shoot you, boy. Wow, wow, wow. Hello. Hello. Oh, wow. Ah. Check me at my guest house this evening. Chuba, Mundo, there. When you come, we will talk things over. We will settle things and nobody will disturb you again. Chuba, I'll be waiting for you. Susan, but come. Tobawa. Timbawa, I will throw your things outside. Chuba. What did you say? Tell me now. Hey! Snake I am finished. So I'll kill you to this world before my end. Hey! I went to see your uncle. You know for what? And he couldn't. That's why we started this petty, petty, petty trade. That he wants to throw us out. Where will I take you children to? Where can I go? Oh God, God, please help me and touch me, Lord. Mama, it's okay. Don't worry. Eh? I'll see what I can do. Don't worry. Where are you going to again? I promise you, nobody will ever disturb your family for house rent again. Sure, Bob? Huh? I'm sorry, I slept at a friend's place. 
I'm sorry I didn't tell you. Shut up! Oh, so you have started sleeping with friends. You have not been sleeping outside. Eh? Let me tell you. The day you decide to be wayward, that is the last day you will step into this house. If you must prostitute, let me know now. The landlord on his quick notice and everything is giving me heart attack. You, you want to start your own now. Eh? Please, just get out. Get, get out. Thank you. Get out. God. Please. Let this landlord forget. Touch him for me. Please, God. Jennifer. Why are you dressed up like this and where are you going to? I'm going out for business. Business? Yes. Since when? Oh, I get it. All right. I'm going to give you the money you asked for. Hmm? But please, don't stretch this any further. When are you giving me the money? This weekend. How much? 200,000 naira, of course. 200,000 naira. I, Jennifer, asked you, Frank, for 200,000 naira. Are you out of your mind? Did I tell you I was going to sell tomato and pepper in the market? But that is what you asked for. I asked for 10 million naira. 10 million what? Naira. What do you need such huge amount of money for? Business, of course. Frank, I need 10 million naira. 10 million naira to start an international business. <laughs> now I mean, I'm... look at me. I have everything any man wants. If you're not going to give the money to me, I might as well just go out there and get it. Now I know you're out of your mind. Hmm? Now, who have you been talking to? Who have you not been talking to? Who have you not been talking to? Oh, you think I'm foolish? Get married and turn into a baby-making machine. What baby-making machine are you talking about? You only have one kid for you for crying out loud. And is that not enough? It's one kid not enough for you. Anyway, I don't know why I'm standing here and having this discussion with you. Jennifer! Jennifer! Get back here! If, if you leave this house, you'll regret it. If I leave this house, what are you going to do? If I leave this house, what are you going to do, you weekly? Frank! You hit me! Hey, you don't shut up, I'll slap you, okay? You raise your hand and hit me! You hit me, Frank! Hey, only tell if I you hit me! I'll show you! If I don't deal with you, I'll show you my two cup! If I don't see you, eh? I provoked him and he gave me this a black eye what? Well, madam, you've done your own part. That is enough to take him to court. Yeah. Okay. You are now in charge. Sure. I'll make him pay for it. before the last consignment arrives. So I hope there is no problem. Uh, uh, Michael, I want you to take charge of the office. I have to dash home quickly. Okay? Uh, uh, my wife just served me a divorce letter. What? what? I thought you people have always been happy together. I mean, uh, she's such a nice woman. That's what you think. Oh, that's what you think. If only you know. Michael, don't be deceived. Not all the glitters is gold. Just, uh, 
Uh, Jennifer, what is this? What does it look like? Huh? What does it look like? You, you want to divorce me over such a trivial issue? Trivial? You call that trivial? You slapped me. You slapped me and almost blinded me. And you call it trivial. Well, you can call it whatever you like. Point is, I want a divorce, period. And if you have read the content of that letter, it says you're going to have to give me 50% of all your properties. And that's it. Jennifer. Look, you, you, you can't do this. Hey, hey, please, just don't touch me. Please. Jennifer, please. Look, all right, I'm sorry. You see, I, I, I lost my temper, okay? But I still love you. What? Yes, I, I really love you. You love me? Yes. <laughs> anyway, I am not prepared to be part of such hazardous love, okay? I want a divorce, and that's final. Oh, you can't do this. Oh, Jennifer, come on, think of me. So please, I love you. And what were you thinking when you hit me? You didn't think about the child when you hit me. You did not think about him. Frank, as a matter of fact, you disgust me. Jennifer. Jennifer, don't do this. Jennifer. You don't think about the child, do you? But I love you. I really love you, Jennifer. Is here. So? But I told you he was coming to lead into a little problem with the oh. house. Are you sure this man is alright? You want to call your uncle to come and discuss the problem between you and I? Hmm? Are they not the ones that have been advising you to beat me? Tell me, are they not the ones that have been advising you to beat me up? You now want to call them so that they can now affect what they have started. Anyway, I can see both of you don't have work. Jennifer. I'm discussing a very serious business with my friend Isaac. Um, Jennifer. When an elder sees evil, I'm failing to warn the young ones. The elder will surely die. But when the elder sees evil and warns the young ones and they refuse to listen, the young ones will certainly die. You will die. It is you that will die. You that is seeing evil everywhere. You that is leaving curses on everybody here. It is you that will die. Do you hear me? Now listen, Frank. You and your rat that family member can go outside or wherever you like and discuss whatever you want to discuss. Don't ever call me back here again. Jennifer! Jennifer! Uncle, I am really very sorry. Uh, please, blame it all on me. Uh, Frank, I have seen all and I have heard all. Uh, thank you. I am going. Uh, Beth, come. Hello, Uncle. What is it? Frank, I think this woman has charmed you. So, let us go to Edibia immediately. How could you don't understand, do you? I mean, it is you, Alice, that say that when a person hides a wrong thing, he has surely done the wrong thing still. Frank, let me advise you, and this is final. What an elder sees sitting down, a child can never see, even when he climbs up on the tree. You marry this woman. And now you still decide to remain with her. So, good luck. I'm going. And as long as this woman is in this house, I will never step my foot in this house again. You remain with your wife if you want to. Thank you. But Uncle, let them... Uncle, let me go come and take you. I don't need your time. I don't need your car. Thank you.
I don't know. Are you still angry at me? Alright. Look, I said I was going to give you the money. All the money you need this weekend, okay? You've said that so many times, okay? Alright. Believe me, look. This is $50,000. What? Once I pay up my debt, I will have all the time in the world to give you all you need. Believe me. Do anything you want. I'll That's give you interesting. All the money. Yes. You give me the money. Have I ever lied to you before? When? Um, this weekend, like I said. This weekend. Okay. I believe you. <laughs> you know, I always thought that uh, you wanted to pull my legs. Well, hmm. Frank. If you promise to give me the money, then I will withdraw the divorce suit. <laughs> you know, this calls for a celebration, what you say? Yeah, it mm? does. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Don't wait. Don't move. Let me get away. Okay. Um. Honey, uh, there's no one here anymore. How come? Well, yes. Since the past week. You haven't noticed. Hmm. I have one of the fridge upstairs in the bedroom. Let me get it. Don't move. I just remember that my lawyer has to travel this evening. He's supposed to travel this evening, yes. So I want to go to his house now and tell him to stop all the cost, court injunction and everything. Because if he travels this night, he may not come back till the next two weeks, or even a month. You know, so let me just go because if we should wait for him to come back, they must start sending the papers and all that. It's embarrassing. They send it to the house. So I, I'll just go upstairs now and change into something no, no, no. better and then go to. No, 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 let this wait. This can wait. We we'll have a night to celebrate. I'll see you. I promise you I'll be back in a very few minutes. Well, at least no more divorce suit. Yes, let me put this in the fridge. Chill while I wait. own works out now. What's her name? Jennifer. Um, if not, we're finished. <laughs> we have nothing to rely on. Oh, uh, baby. You don't have to be bothered. Maya's going to work, okay? I'll just pray. Give me a drink. Oh, yeah. Um. What have you been doing? Mm -hmm. Thank God. Okay. Ah, Jenny! Um, where's your calling? So important. There's no problem. I, I've, I've decided not to divorce him anymore. What? Do you know what this has caused? Yeah, I know, I know. It's all right. I know. As a matter of fact, eh, I have five million naira with me now. That's in my bag. The equivalent in dollars. Oh, you know what? I mean, I have the equivalent in dollars. Forty thousand dollars. Don't worry, it's a long story, Stella. I'll tell you later. Um, uh, can I have the partnership deal to sign now? Yes. Um, um, no, no. No, you see, actually, uh, it's not possible. I I have to pay in the money into the Italian account, first of all, so that they can send the documents of partnership for me. That's yes, the only way yes. I can get it. Oh, really? Yeah. 
So, so how long is that going to take? Not too long, just one week. Mm -hmm. One week. That means I'm going to have to stay with you people in this house for that one week. You know, I stole the money from my husband. And if he finds out, the hell is going to be let loose. That's okay. Yes. I can stay with you, right? Yes. For as long as you want. Yes. Uh, Jenny, no, you know, your husband will be looking for you. Exactly. You see, the only thing you need is to, I mean, you need a very cool hideout where you can go and stay for the whole week. Then when the documents are ready, fine. Maybe off we go. Precisely by now, I'm sure he must have reported to the police and they'll be on the lookout for you everywhere and they'll find you if care is not taken. So what we need to do is just to put you in a, in a hotel where you can stay. Within one week, we'll process the documents and we're off. I know of a very better place where you can hide okay. and stand. So I'll make a call. Can I, can I have the money now? The money? Yeah. Okay. That's $40,000. It's okay. Um, just keep it. Excuse me. Let me make the call. Um, hello? Yeah. Uh, is that Washington's uh, hotel? Yeah, please. I need a reservation for a suite. Yeah, just one. I wonder why my mother will want to ask with $40,000. Story of my life, Michael. Now I know I am a serious marital problem. I I I, I wonder why a woman will want to run away with the husband's money. Don't you give allowances? What? Michael, I pay her fifty thousand naira every month. And I recently bought, just bought her a brand new car. But all I ever get is nag, nag, nag. Tell me, Michael, what, 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 look at me. What have I done wrong? What have I done wrong for crying out loud? So what are you going to do now? Do I tell the police that my wife is a thief so that they can put her on the most wanted list? Huh? Michael, I've been thinking. I'm going to get a room in one of those face me, I face you buildings somewhere in the jungle there. You know, it just dawned on me that I've been mixing with the wrong set of women all this while. Mm, yes. <laughs> anyway, I know it's not going to be difficult. After all, I started my life from that place. And my real true love is back there. I don't understand this. Are you telling me you're going to ejaculate to search for a true love? <laughs> so I don't understand this. <laughs> Neither do I. But that is exactly what I am going to do. Yes, sir. How about the money? I mean, the forty thousand dollars. Well, it's just money. Let's go in this way. It's a sacrifice, and it's both the money and Jennifer. Psst, bye bye. Good riddance to bad rubbish. <laughs> but our manufacturers are abroad. They are owing a lot of money. Yeah, yeah, I know. But don't worry yourself, Michael. <sighs> well, so true. We always do. Okay? All of my life, I've been searching for love. A love that is real, faithful and true. Faithful and true. Oh, I'll do anything. Go anywhere. I'll go anywhere. You can climb the highest mountain. Swim the deep sea, deep sea in search of love. Life has not been fair to me. I fell in love with someone. I fell in love with me. Oh, my God! 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 Oh, my God!
Yes. Achiyoma. Eh, eh, eh. My name no be Chioma again. Now I am Tessy. Tessy. Hey, look at you. Look at me. Long time no see. So why don't you people come to the village anymore? You're, you and your parents. You don't come home anymore. Why? It's a long story, Chioma. Eh, long story, there. Eh. What do you do for a living now? Not a living. Eh. Well, you know the person I saw. Ah, one of my bubbles. You know, I have a whole lot of them. I practically pick and choose. Hey, hey, what, what are you doing? I guess nothing. You just, I don't know. You guess nothing. Eh, let's, let's eat something. I just want to eat something. Eh. So, no, I mean, tell me. That's for you. That's for you. Eh. Hey. So that's what has been happening to your family. Yeah, for you. So what are you going to do now? I don't know. I'm so confused. But I don't really mind to do anything to make money. At least I want to help my family. Mm -hmm. I have to. What are you doing? Smoking. You want one? No, no, no. You smoke? Oh my God. Listen, smoking is bad for you. Besides, Smoking is for waywards and prostitutes. <laughs> My dear Susan, you're looking at one. What? You? <laughs> A prostitute? <laughs> we all are. As long as you have boyfriends, bedmates, casual sex partners, you're a prostitute. Only difference is, some don't get paid. That is where prostitutes are different and even better. Please. I don't want to be part of this. And please, I just I just don't want this. Just Susan! 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 What is wrong with you? Eh? What is wrong with you? You think you are better than me? Just look at the faces of people on the streets. They all have their secrets of survival. You don't have. That is why you're being manipulated anyhow. For God's sake, look at me. I'm building a house in the village. I'm living fine. If you want to help your brothers and your, 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 your sisters and your mother in the village, you better know what to do about it. Do something. You don't understand. I want to help my family, not disgrace them. I, I just can't. I'm sorry. Susan, you have to think. You're a young girl, for God's sake. What you did with your landlord yesterday was not prostitution. It was a sheer slavery of the 21st century. See, we operate deep in town. Where people who know us don't get to see us. We don't get to meet people who know us. Anyway, just go think about it. I'll wait for you here tomorrow at a particular time. If I don't see you, I'll know that you're not serious. I was worried now, eh? I was worried my daughter. Where have you been? Mama, I want to see a friend. Eh, hey, Susan, I am sorry I quarreled with you. Hmm? The landlord did not come again. What happened? He instead he sent his driver to bring us some money to manage. That's it's wonderful. a miracle. <laughs> I thought the I mean I thought he was a very wicked man. Oh, he's not. I thank God. That's nice, Mama. <laughs> uh, your brothers, they are preparing for school. They will soon be around. In to me, I fell in love with someone. I thought we'd love me. But now I realize it wasn't real life. All this while, it was just a lie. I gave up.
Searching for love, see a love that's 